How's it going, everybody? Dotanoi here, back with another video for you all today. And if you've been around the channel long enough, you might know that I really enjoy fighting games, which is why usually when a new one gets announced, I like to talk about it here on the channel in at least one video, just because I'm usually so excited. Today's announcement, though, is one that I don't think anybody saw coming, so we'll just cut straight to the chase. We're talking about Nickelodeon's All-Star Brawl. Yes, that's right. This is actually real. Nickelodeon is releasing a massive cross over fighter between all of their biggest franchises and while not a two-dimensional fighter it is taking on that smash style of gameplay so if smash can be at the big fighting game tournaments this should be at the big fighting game tournaments and i genuinely mean that because i am actually very excited for this roster even in this very small trailer they have shown a wide array of characters from all across nickelodeon's biggest properties i mean they're showing stuff from the loud house which to be honest i have no idea what the loud house is i know it's popular nowadays it wasn't really a show when i was around watching cartoons on Nickelodeon. But I mean, come on. They also have Nigel Thornberry as a playable character, Reptar. This is going to be a game for literally everybody that has ever watched a cartoon. And if Nickelodeon's going after their bigger franchises to put in this game, does that mean we might be seeing some Avatar stuff in this game? That's what I would be really excited to see. You know, Aang would be a sick playable character. Korra, I, the guy with the the, the boom, I, the, the guy with the boomerang. I don't know why I can't get his name right. Toph. Toph would also be another good one. Um, man, there's just so many different choices you could use for the avatar series hopefully they go with at least a few of those but man the roster is what has me excited the most like i said i mean come on danny phantom's in the game danny phantom's in the game i mean yeah his model might look a little ugly but I, he's in the game he's still there and another thing i wanted to bring up early in this video just in case some of you aren't sold on this yet is that the game also reportedly has rollback netcode that is right this game will have better netcode than a lot of other bigger fighting games now we're not totally sure on that yet this is coming to us from a dev on discord that said on supported platform so we're definitely going to have to look at this closer but if it's true i mean rollback netcode on a game like this are we also gonna get dlc i mean how many characters are we gonna see here in the description of the video it also mentions that it's going to have 20 themed levels such as jellyfish fields and tmnt's technodrome so they're also doing the smash thing of taking stages from across the universes as well so that's another thing to get really excited for it man they are actually trying with this game it looks like i'm excited now just because i know it's going to be fun to mess around with some friends online but if this game came out when i was younger man that would have been wild so i guess my question to you all would be who are you going to main in this game i mean broly fans you might want to look into playing patrick there's actually a lot of similarities there in their move set personally i might be either a danny phantom main or if those avatar characters come out i might switch over maybe you might have to have a secondary reptar you know just for some matchup i'm interested in seeing what characters you guys are looking forward to playing and what characters you guys would like to see in a crossover game like this. I feel like this video is mostly just talking about speculating characters, but Timmy Turner, Jimmy Neutron, I mean, come on. You gotta get some of the class. Maybe they'll even put Carl in the game, bro. Croissant. Also, while we're making this video, just in case the developers are watching, please put in a final smash orb kind of technique. I would love to see like some high octane energy cutscene cinematic <laughs> super. I, I don't know why I would just love to see that, but I def, I need that. I need that. Wait, this is actually Dotto from a long time after I recorded the audio. I just realized another character that has to be in the game. It's Jay Million. Yo, get Jenny in the game as well, bro. I forgot about Jenny. Put Jenny in the game as well. All right back to the back to the present dotto but yeah that's pretty much everything i had to say i mostly just wanted to cover that this game is now coming into existence cartoon network hopefully will do something similar hey cartoon network between you and me if they're gonna do the smash style how about you do a 2d style you know maybe we see ben 10 someday in a fighting game uh but yeah that's gonna cover it for now hopefully you guys enjoyed this video again let me know down below who you're going to main i, I don't even know what the point of this video was but man i'm just i'm excited to play this game with some friends online and maybe stream it or something like that but i'm gonna get out of here hopefully you enjoyed it if you did let me know down below uh, in the comment section leave a like subscribe if you're excited uh and stick around for more nickelodeon all-star gameplay we'll do some ranked matches but i've been dr noya i'll see you in the next video have a good one